Hello to us. Hope you enjoy about so today. Today's gonna be ten top ten re in for 2021 in UK. The ones who couldn't make the list are Fun Fun Bo Fun Boys 3 in Manchester. So this one here is because I haven't been here, so I don't know what the locals is like. But what I heard from my first is it's very good local, so so we know it's good locals. It looks quite big but it's quite far so you will need to so it's 200 so, so if we were going Manchester for example we'll go on the train now now for these reasons a lot of things will have to change I know there's no stupid rules because of things my rule will be you have to book in advance make sure you got all your equipment ready do your deck list before because hey don't like some people do that glitch while they're there. It it makes things not look very good. Okay, not very all kind of. And yeah, it's, it's one of the things. Okay, so then we can just get on with the day. <laughs> so, uh, the next one is Firestorm cards. Now I haven't been to Baden Stokes local of locals or regional place, but. Her, it was really hard to find a picture of the place looks like. There's not many good pictures of the place, which is okay. Um, it's quite far for a regional to go to. Yeah, it would be quite far. Uh, and I don't know the players. It's the same with Manchester one pretty much. And Gyrex, well I know one of the players. It's Alex Richards. It's place there. And the locals I heard is pretty good, but it's pretty small. So I don't know about how many See, it's quite small, so this means a number of things. It means they'll probably have to host another venue. It's big enough, but they'll have to host another venue for it. Yeah. And Alex said, don't go to Alex Challenge and one, because that one's not very good, because he's got bad reputation, and he's a bit of a... I don't know, it's a bit rude, but he sort of cheated and get his own way to everything, which is not good, I think, which is not good at all. Oh. No, no, and that's 40, that's 52, and I mean 54, and 76 players, and this is 106. So, this is, and then the next one on the actually number 10 is actually the South Sea the Metro near Portsmouth. So, this is their local or regional place will be. So, so, but probably in host something else. So, so, this is actually a good local straight away. You could tell you know where you're going. Pshum. There's the dragon, there's the curse shop, there's Pokemon, there's magic, there's Lugio, bam! It hits you straight in the face. That's all quite good. I mean this is the sort of locals is sort of perfect. You wanna to go to E4 Regional? This is good. This is good. Because you know where it is. Straight away. You remember the face quite well. It's just good. It's a stink. Yes, I never been to this store, but I heard it's got good reports and it's a good one to go to, yeah. We'll try when we get to reach us 120 miles, 120 players, which is quite funny, it's literally my players. So, this, the problem I have also is on Sundays, I do it on them. When when things get back to normal, I think we'll get regionals around July and August, around that sort of time, we might be able to be alright to get some. So, it's been amazing that's just doing some work, we're doing some stuff for the Grimmer stuff, you know, Grimmer stuff is coming up, we have to do it. All ready for Grimmer, yep. Next one, this is Ace Gaming Central in Colchester. Now I have never been to this one, but my friend Re um, Mark Reed's been here, and he said it's a nice locals, but small, so so probably be able to go. Oh, oh, we were about to go, but lockdown happened. It didn't happen anyway. Yeah, yeah. So it didn't be able to go ahead. So. It anyway, it was even before lockdown. Yeah. So I would love to go to this one because it's a nice store. I heard it's a good store. Now it's in the central bit of Colchester, so it's 104 miles. So it won't take very long. It'll take maybe a, a hour. Maybe it'll take an hour and a half to drive there for that regional. Yeah, it'd be a good regional. It'd be a nice one. Uh, and the store doesn't look that bad. I wish it had, it's got a schedule so we know how things happen. 
and, and Liga's on Saturdays or Sundays, yeah. So it looks like it's these two days that are Liga. Rest days are Magic, Car Fight, Vanguard, there's Pokemon. I'm not sure what other things are on there, but I bet there's other stuff too. Which would be good. Next one is Incom Game. This is in Cheltenham. So this is a core cool locals, okay? This is just not a locals. Let's get them to cloud. It's not just a local. This is a pub. Oh, so yes, you can grab a pint, <laughs> pretty much, and play some Luigi. That's the that's the neat thing about this. Oh, let me grab a pint and let me grab and let me buy some cards. <laughs> yeah, it's sort of one of those funny night spins you can go to. It's just a big long shop, pretty much. It's two floors, so it's quite space out. It doesn't look that big space, but when you actually go in, it's absolutely massive. Inside, there's loads of stuff. There's Lucas, there's Pokemon, Magic, Car Fight, Vanguard, there's Transformers, there's absolutely everything here. Pretty much, this is everywhere. And plus, this is in a Perth location. It's on what they call Third Street. And basically, this local is basically next to it is a Greg's, a McDonald's, a Burger King, a Pinto Monte, a pretty much, it's in the local centre. And you've got a Weatherspoons if you want to get breakfast. So it's got pretty much everything. Yep, it's more of a drinking bar, but that's fine. To be honest, I wouldn't grab a drink there very often, but for the locals and for really drunk, it's very good and very good. The players are good there too. You've got some good range of players. You've got, you've got the combo players, you've got the control players, and you've got like Lua, you've got all sorts of weird decks you can play there. I'm not sure what the sort of mayor is. It's on Wednesday, the locals, so it's not even good to get to, but regional. Once a year is pretty good for me. Yeah. Next one is in electronic gaming in air, in in Reddit. Never been to this one, but I heard good things about this one, so they must be pretty good. So I hear good things about this regional, about about the Reddit one. So I hear it's good. It's a little looks like a small little store, but bet it's bigger inside. Yeah, it's a nice. I'm not sure, uh, it looks like it's on the high street. I've never been to this one, but I think it's good. I'm always here at Portsmouth. I always wanted to go, but I never get anyone to drive me down to it. Yeah, and it's always on a Saturday, so I would go, but I would have to change my schedule. Oh, and stuff like that. I think that'd be, this is a good one. Yeah. Next is Escape. Escaping, Escape Games in, in Comfrey. My friend spins this one. Um, once, so my friend James Crook, he's one of my local players I play against, he's played against me in Ellsbury, Milne Kings, Bedford, Cambridge, all sorts of these places. We go to these locals all together because me and James are the same sort of player. We are very good players, but James is one of those players who doesn't have any belief in himself, so he doesn't do so well as he should do. Because it, because he knows the decks he should be playing, he can't remember things very well, so he has to play control decks because they don't they're, they're not too complicated for him to actually remember things with it. Yep. And the same with so so what I heard there were not many players, but he didn't do very well. There was only like four. He didn't do very well, which is a shame. So this is not very big regional, so again this is on sad, but it's lucky it's not a high, it's just one train ticket, one train ticket away really, you just go on the train and get on the train, which is pretty good. Good, good, I'm not sure what this one's like, but while I'm here, it's alright. It's near Tesco, so I know where it is, but I don't know how far it is from the train station, I'll have to look in commentary where how far it is, when I actually do it, and stuff like that. Next one is... Um, Zebra War Game. So this is in Aylesbury. Now this is a this. I know I've actually been to the shop, but I've been to regional and in a hotel. Okay, I've been to the regional, but I've been actually to the locals itself. Yeah, which is very. It's a very good. It's a very good regional. It's just a big hotel. It's hell. It's hell, and it basically it's in one big room. So this is a, this is the. It's in one massive room. It's like a conference room, and basically this room's like massive. And you basically you watch your players, and you might go off and have a bit of lunch. Well, you play your first round, have a bit of lunch. Hopefully, you get on time to actually play your round. Because I almost sort of had my lunch before the regional. 
this one. It's a good regional. I didn't do so well last time, but last couple of times I actually done pretty quite. Have one time I've done pretty well with stuff. I think it's a, it's a good regional. It's good what it does. The players are very good. You got you got a wide scope players. This is one of my last ones before we had this proper last year. So so this is good. This is actually a good one. Income was the lower from before we had the virus, so that's why I feel we don't even get on with the other stuff with it. So it's so was drive, so it's pretty it's pretty good, so it's not too bad. Next one is I've been to this one. This is Level Up Gaming. So Level Up Gaming in Bournemouth. So it's on a little side road. It's sort of not in the town centre, it's sort of outside Bournemouth, it's sort of in the outskirts, but it's one of the local bits. Bournemouth, so, so you'll go drive down and you you will drive past this stuff by the way. You will drive past this. Yeah, you will drive past this. This this. Okay, it looks obvious, but it's not. Okay, the same The store's very small. It's very small but nice. The owner's absolutely lovely. He's called Matt and he absolutely loves this store. You know, he loves Ludo to bits, and that's the sort of guy you are. And I asked about what the other people they said, oh, they're just higher place. So this is kind of was the guy who's down to earth and he's showing me the inside bit, the downstairs. So the downstairs is basically downstairs, and it's with this one, but there's two sides. And this is pre COVID when we had a lot. This is COVID still, but had, had one side and one side, so you couldn't mix. I didn't have my stuff, but I would have gone down, but at the same time, we were all here with my parents, so it was fine. So it's a nice locals. It's a good one. I don't know what the players like, but I bet it would have been the same as Milton Keynes or when I sometimes go for some other ones. Yeah, it would have been interesting here. It's a good one. It's definitely a good one. It's definitely a good one a chance, but it's full. It's seventy six players and one hundred forty two. So, so it won't be very often. A one. I think I will never get a chance to go to this one. But it's nice. I actually got to go to the shop. because it's too far away. Yeah. Next one is a t number three, and number four, five, and six. Well, well an A and ten. Then is is a, a, um, a sneak attack get games in London. So I love this one. This one was pretty good. This is one of those reasons I always wanted to go to, but it's on a Saturday, and so I couldn't go. And it's on the train, so I will have to go and get one of my friends to help me get there and stuff like that. We had to actually plan the route, but I heard the place is very good and very good to get to. Very, very good. Good, good, good. It looks like a nice collector store. I think it'd be good. I, it has quite a good amount of players, a hundred players. That means it's not too bad. It must be the locals must be upstairs and s s and six nine miles. You would have to get two trains. You would have to change from London. You had to change from London Newton and get to West Ham. Go on to go, go on to Central Line. Stop at West Ham. Then seventeen minute walk from the train station. Okay, which is pretty cool. And we know where it is. It sort of sticks out. Next one is Comic Gaming and and Coffee in. Farm in Fandas, Farnborough. This is a pretty cool one. You get a coffee with your store. This one looks more a magic face, but but I bet this will leave you in there somehow. Yeah, because they had a regional last year here. It looks a pretty cool one. I haven't been here personally, but I know it's good. I know it'll be good. So, but it's a long way away. It's 60 players and it's 125 miles. Yep. This is number two. So cool which is good good so I haven't been here that's all really like to say about and then the best one top deck in because it's our local ones it's the best it's the best shop it does well and the owners are good they do they organize it well they know what they're doing very well uh, and they know what they're gonna be doing each time uh, I think this is one of the best reasons and hopefully we'll have it again for next for next year yeah we don't know what's going to be going ahead. Now let's hope the vaccine's doing all right and actually makes it clear enough to do all that thing again. Because, because the way things are going out, we might be going down and the vaccine's in the way. Okay. I think this would be a good regional and it's good because it's it's got a good amount of tables and good amount of space. Yeah, nice. And you should lunch here, but now you don't. You have to go somewhere else. So hopefully that will be sorted. Okay, but but it's fine if you want a quick coffee and play some league, that's pretty good too. Okay. 
pretty good. And there's other things too. There's magic, there's Pokemon, there's Transformers, there's pretty much Digimon. Now Digimon's a card game now. Summer's come back. Uh, game of Thrones, uh, Transformers. Uh, there's all sorts of card games here. Car Fight Vanguard's here. It's pretty much got a four week schedule. Not now, but pretty much a four week schedule when things are actually on. And it's always been, things are always on, which is a good thing. Yep, and you've got snacks. And that, which is good, because sometimes you just need something to cheer yourself up. up. Okay, well, that's, the, that's the list for the top 10 regionals for the UK 2021 uh, 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 for next year. Now, hope you enjoyed it today and subscribe and watch all. Oh, keep safe. Hey, wash your hands. Hands and get your top of the virus. As, and hopefully, we'll be back playing soon at locals and regionals. Not sure of a wife, yes, yep, but regionals and stuff. Hopefully, that will go ahead. And hopefully, we can get back playing soon, okay? Hey, I hope you enjoyed today and subscribe and watch all. Share me on Facebook and Instagram and all the other websites, okay? Yes, I am on Instagram. I don't post very much, but when I can do, I will post it. I will post this on here. Okay, I hope you enjoyed today and subscribe and watch it. And see you all next time. Goodbye.